Hi, thank you for calling Home with Sweet Talk. Can I help you? Hello? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm an idiot. I had you on mute, so I'll have to start over now. Uh, <laughs> okay, I'm, a guest, I'm a guest. I'm up in the bathroom. Everything's cool. But uh-huh. um, I had read somewhere that is, – is it true that if you eat the soap in the bathroom here that you don't get sick from it? Um, I've never heard that. Well, that's not the experience that I'm having. Okay. Um, you ate the soap? I thought that it wouldn't – I thought it – because they had always said, oh, you know, eat the soap. It won't make you sick. Mm-hmm. But now I, I, I mean, I wouldn't say like I'm, I'm not like sick. I don't have a fever or nothing. But you know what I mean. Like I don't feel so hot. Yeah. How much of it did you eat? The bottle. Oh, it was the bottle, not the bar. Yeah. No, I wouldn't eat a bar of soap. I'm not an idiot. Right. Um. How? What solutions do you want me to give you? Wait. Was this shampoo? Maybe that's where the problem is. Oh. So I. Sh- okay. Do you think I should eat? I should eat the bar of soap. Then you're saying. No. But Do I not eat the bar of soap. But I can. That's the one that I can eat that won't make me sick. That's no. got to be the problem. So, oh, my God, I am an idiot. I drink the shampoo instead of eating the soap. <laughs> Holy shit. That explains it. I really appreciate your help. So as soon as I figure I'll probably shit this out in like a half hour or something, and then I'll eat the bar of soap, and I should be okay. I mean, I wouldn't eat the bar of soap solely based on the taste. But... No, I'm not, I don't care about that. I'm just – I would like to see – if it's not going to make me sick, then that's... Yeah, I'd like to eat it. I don't think that's a good idea. Uh, well, I'm, all that I'm really concerned with is the fact that it's not supposed to make you sick. I and think I'd it like, will make you sick. Well, I'd like to experience that. Because there's uh, this guy on the internet, and he said that he was a, um, he'd was he worked at the Homeless Suites before, and that he was a lawyer. And he said no. So that's why I, would, I wanted to try it. Because he's like a lawyer and stuff. So you believe that... If you eat soap, it won't make you sick because of a lawyer online said it? Well, he also – he was an ex-employee of the Homeless Suites. Had he eaten the soap, though? I didn't ask him. Like, I just read – it was. It wasn't like, – it was like a blog like a, on an internet forums page. He was saying – Oh. He's like, yeah, I'm a lawyer. He's like, no, you won't get sick. Because someone else had asked, oh, is it true? Everyone's always saying that, you know. Everyone's always saying at the Homeless Suites you can eat the soap. I mean, I think you would get sick just because you always get sick when you eat wait, soap. I'm pretty sure that once a lawyer's under oath, they can't lie anyway, can they? Well, was he under oath? I don't I mean, know. I mean, it was a blog post, so can you prove that it was he was under oath? I mean, you're he's right. A, well, he's a lawyer. He wouldn't lie, though, I'm thinking. I mean, it's lawyers the law. lie. Well, no, it's the law. What law is it? I'm, I'm, not, a, I'm not a lawyer myself. Right, he is, not you. It's probably freedom freedom of speech or something, probably. Yeah. So, I all right, like I said, I'll just wait 15, 20 minutes here. Because it's like, a, you know, you can feel it moving, the shampoo that I drank. Yeah. <laughs> feel it moving down in the tummy. Um, do you think I should eat bread or induce vomiting or anything? I think you should maybe call poison control. Oh, it's just shampoo. I eat shampoo all the time. I mean, if you're used to it... Well, no, this is a a different – why I thought it wasn't supposed to make you feel sick like this. Like normally at home, I eat the shampoo. I drink – well, not a lot. It's all all a matter of measuring it out. And that's why I think these travel bottles are so good because, I mean, you're not going to get like seriously sick. Pre-measured, yeah. Yeah, exactly. You're not going to get seriously sick. But it doesn't doesn't feel good. And this is like how it feels at home when I eat the – when I drink the shampoos at home. That explains everything really. Well, I'm glad you figured out your solution, um, but I don't think you should eat the bar of soap. Um, when I'm at if home, yeah. Need... If I'm at home, it, that one, that one, because that one sits in your stomach for a while. That one's very unpleasant. Yeah, yeah. So normally I mean, the shampoo solid. would be passed as a liquid pretty quickly. Yes. Yeah. So, but I, this one, I've heard good things. I've heard really good things about it, and I'm looking forward to it. And I'm sorry that I was such an idiot and I did that. I thought it was like a liquid soap, because he didn't say anything about biting it. He just said, you mm. know, eat. He said, eat Well, if you it. need any more shampoo to I eat might. or just to use, just feel free to come down to the front desk. And then, okay, I feel I'm detecting like a flirty vibe. Is that accurate? Mm, no, I'm gay, but thank you. That's fine. I like that as well. Oh, okay. Okay, all right, good. So I'll come down and we'll make first contact. We'll ma- okay. And we'll After take you it from get there. Done- Decimating the toilet. Oh, yeah. No, we'll yeah. Give me, give me 15. We'll give me 15 to shit out the shampoo, and then I'll be down. <laughs> okay. And then maybe, maybe, 
maybe we'll have a love connection. We'll see what happens. Thank you. Maybe. You know, I did just get broken up with, so maybe we oh, will. Oh, shit. All right, yeah. All right, I'll try and shit as quick as I can. Thank you. <laughs> okay, goodbye. I love you. <laughs>